Okay, everybody, I'm back. Sorry about the delay on this. It's been cold outside and I don't work in the cold. But here I'm gonna be starting a new series. This is gonna be our our truck rebuild. This is a 2001 Dodge Ram 1500, four by four. It's got that 318 V8 Magnum in it. Bought it from a deputy sheriff. I know he uh, he's had it since it was new. It's got a brand new transmission rear end in it. Um, engines doesn't leak and says it's all solid it's got new tires on it um, pretty good looking truck you know some changes obviously are gonna be made all that silly chrome stuff's coming off of there all the trims coming off of there we're gonna be running that uh, Raptor lining on it uh, we're gonna take this bed liner out and Raptor line the bed um, but here and yeah he's left it full of trash that was nice of him but uh, you know to probably change out the tail lights the headlights stuff like that but here's here's where the fun begins let me get you over here it had a fire nice toasty toasty he believes it was the fan motor caught fire probably locked up and the leaves in there caught fire and torched it so got to find me a junkyard and go get me a whole new dash put up in here luckily these come out in one piece um so i'll swap all that out and get some new seats there the back seat in here is fine i'm gonna take it out and surprisingly the the door panel besides covered with fire extinguisher soot or whatever the door panels on both doors is fine so we're gonna leave those so i'm gonna probably replace the, this carpet down here with vinyl because this is gonna be a work truck um so i'm gonna put a vinyl floor in here replace all this put new heater core blower motor i'll put new where i can I'm gonna put a, a nice doubled in stereo in it and uh, you know just make it decent and got a new windshield a lot of plastic pieces here are gonna have to be replaced the handles the whole headliner have to come out I'll have a, a upholstery shop do that um, yeah and all this stuff and luckily none of the glass besides the windshields toast so I just need to start replacing plastic um and this whole piece here kind of melted a bit and the same on that other side for some reason right up in there is where it burnt uh doors work i mean this was loaded at the time power windows locks um i don't think it had power seats but i like these seats well how they were let's see if i can get this hold on there we go i like i like the oem seats but these are too far toasted to bother to reupholster re so i'll have to replace these and then get them reupholstered because i think we are going to go with like a gray and black interior and then a hunter green coating on the outside oh, looks like i'm about to order some new windshield trim with the windshield <coughs> and uh so yeah that's going to be a project uh, i've i've worked under dashes and pulled them out but i've never totally swapped one I'm a little bit worried about the wiring. You see a lot of bare wire up under there, so this may be a good trick. Um, we'll see. Um, like I said, I know that these come right out, and uh, the wiring harness unplugs. Uh, worst case, I get another wiring harness. Um, this front part where the blower motor was did melt down, but... Uh, the computer and everything luckily is on this side of the firewall and it doesn't look like anything got too hot on the firewall so i should be i should be okay there it's got a new exhaust and everything on it um he really loved this thing it was something his wife bought him and and unfortunately she died in 2018 poor guy and um he's ready to let it go he got remarried recently so he's ready to let it go and i'm gonna I'm going to carry the, the torch now and fix her up, and we're going to see how crazy we can get with it. I know 318 may not necessarily be the most powerful, but I'm, I'm not looking to drag race or, or climb mountains. I'm looking to pull a trailer, but uh, I think we can clean it up, get some nice aftermarket shocks and stuff on there. I don't mind the rims. I definitely don't. I mean, those are really good tires. Um... I don't mind the rims, but I don't want the silver. I want to black it. I want to black the whole thing out. It's already got good tint and everything on it. <laughs> it doesn't look bubbled, but uh, but yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't mind blacking it all out. So that's where we're at. I'll uh, get this video updated and or uploaded, and I'm gonna start tearing it down. I'm gonna record as much as this as I possibly can, 
and uh, let's have some fun if you guys got any ideas uh, what I can do to this thing let me know appreciate it